then I'm going to move on and do a sensitizing lesson, which I think she'll be pretty good at since she likes to move around, and I'm going to yield her hindquarters. So I'm going to start in front of her shoulder and just rub her with my stick. I find using the stick first easier, so I'm going to bend, step toward her hindquarters, and then tap her on the hip there, and then I'll rub her till she stops. So I like to wrap the rope around my stick and use that because I feel like that's a little bit easier, but I also do my rope. So I step up, bend, step toward her hindquarters, tap on her hind end until she moves, and then I'll rub her to a stop. So I always want to start above her shoulder because I want to desensitize her there. So she's moving around, I keep desensitizing. Bend, step, tap, very nice. And I was right, she's pretty good at this. Rub her till she stands still. And then I want to rub her up here just to desensitize her. She gets a little worried when I approach her, so make sure she's not moving. Then step right toward her hindquarters, and perfect. She crosses over. Very good. Rub her to a stop. I want her to cross her inside hind leg over her outside. I'm going to step directly toward that hind leg. Very good. If it's important you step right there, you want to take that space and move her out of it instead of just stand, stepping around her. You really want to step right straight toward it. There we go. So the goal here is to just bend and step toward her and then she moves away from her. But I'll stop when she does it, just a good couple steps. I don't want to ask for too much in the beginning. So I'm releasing as soon as she takes one good crossover step at first, then I'll build on that. Step, tap, 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 wait for her, there she crosses, and I'll rub her till she stops. And it's important that you stand up straight in rubber because you want her to read the difference in your body length up there, she's not moving, a bend, step, tap, perfect, stand up, rubber to a stop. Very good. Over there, she just wanted to throw her head around. There she wanted to move when I walked up, so I want to make sure and just desensitize her. There she's not moving, so I'll go ahead and yield her hindquarters. Very good. She wants to she doesn't love when you kind of rub her face sometimes, so I want to make sure she's good with that, and I do it a lot. And step. There, I didn't need a tap. Very good. She's catching on. Stand up straight. Rub her till she stops. Very good. Rub her face. Do extra sensitizing. Keep her attention on me. Come up to her. She wants to move around, so I'm going to wait and desensitize and start again. Not moving, so I'll go ahead and yield them. Tap, tap, very good. Back up at her shoulder. And I'm just going to desensitize. I'll always end by desensitizing her. Or make sure I can walk up there standing up straight, rub on her, and make sure she's okay with that. So you don't want her to get too worried and then just move every time you come up to her. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. For this lesson, I like to keep all my uh, rope in my hand so it doesn't get caught up around our feet just because she'll be pivoting a lot. We're going to do the exact same thing on our left side. So sensitize her a bit. Make sure she's okay with me walking up. Bend, step, tap. There she goes, release, and rub her till she stops. up, sensitize, make sure she's okay with it, bend, step, perfect, rubber, after she gives me a couple good steps, this kind of depends on the horse, like if she's really sticky, I'll reward, I'll end the lesson by just getting her to step over even when I'm tapping with her, but I really want to end um, when she's just going off of my body language. So if she does a step or two just step off of body language, I'll stop for the day. She's not moving, so I'll bend, step, and there she goes. So she's really getting this lesson pretty good, so that's awesome. And she's going to do this first before I lunge her, because yielding the hindquarters is a big part of that. And she did great.